hundreds of people drive through Nederland every day, some with outstanding warrants for traffic violations. Well, I just feel like, you know, we've got a lot of outstanding warrants. In fact, more than 2,000 active Class C misdemeanor warrants. Chief Darrell Bush says putting them online gives people another way to know if a warrant has their name on it. Warrants are public record anyway, and that will allow people to go on there and look and see if they possibly have a warrant or someone they know possibly has a warrant. If they do, they can come down and clear it up. Bush says it's a courtesy that may help people avoid more trouble. A person out here now, and he gets stopped, he or she gets stopped somewhere, uh, and there's a warrant on them, then whatever agency has stopped them, is going to pick them up and put them in jail on our warrant. So then before they can get out of jail, they're going to have to come down here and pay that warrant off. This is giving them an opportunity not to have to go through that process. I think it would be good so that you could uh, find out if you actually have a warrant. You know, <laughs> if you have a warrant, you know, I'd like to know before I get out on the road and get pulled over and stop and end up going to jail. Get it taken care of beforehand. Well, it's an embarrassment. That might make somebody go run in and pay it, you know, and things like that. But I, I don't. I just don't think that's the best reason to do. I think it'd be a good idea to have it that way. You won't have a surprise if you're pulled over. The Beaumont Police Department already has an active warrants list posted on the city's website. It's been very uh, successful, mostly for the citizens who may have just inadvertently forgotten to pay their traffic tickets. So it, it offers them a way to get in there without being arrested and an extra opportunity to clear it up. In Nederland, Haley Bull, Fox 4 News.